Welcome back to Open World TV Channel. Today, I would like to introduce to you the most noteworthy unmanned super object of the U.S. Navy. This is a top secret research and experimental project since 2020 by the U.S. Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, DARPA. This submarine has a width of 20 meters, equivalent to 72 feet, and a length of 14 meters, equivalent to 45 feet. It has just been deployed by the U.S. Navy in the South China Sea. Its name is Manta Ray, a formidable predator at the bottom of the ocean. With a shape similar to a giant oceanic manta ray, manta ray is a top secret unmanned underwater vehicle, UUV, developed by the United States. It integrates advanced technical solutions to become a lethal force in the ocean. The goal is to develop autonomous UUV capable of carrying weapons and performing long range, long duration missions in the ocean environment without human support or a mothership. One of the main challenges in developing manta ray is designing efficient and durable energy systems to allow for months-long operations without recharging. This submarine is also equipped with technology to avoid collisions, handle underwater hazards, and perform tasks in difficult oceanic terrain and weather conditions. Such UUVs are expected to become valuable tools for intelligence gathering, surveillance, target tracking, and launching surprise attacks, helping the U.S. Navy gain an advantage in potential underwater conflicts. Northrop Grumman spent four years developing a UUV with all these advantages. In April, the company released the first images of the manta ray prototype. This unmanned vehicle has a shape almost identical to a manta ray. Northrop Grumman emphasized that its modular design allows for easy disassembly and transport in containers. In emergencies, manta ray can be deployed faster than traditional submarines. Dr. Kyle Warner, DARPA's manta ray program director, stated that this is a unique capability for a large UUV, allowing for rapid global deployment. Northrop Grumman completed underwater testing of manta ray off the coast of Southern California in February and March this year. The tests demonstrated that the mechanical ray is fully capable of underwater combat. According to Northrop Grumman, manta ray is designed to perform long duration, wide range underwater missions without on-site human support. To achieve this, the UUV must not only use minimal energy, but also absorb energy from the ocean. There are two ways to solve the energy problem. One is to absorb solar energy. However, in deep sea areas where sunlight cannot reach, the UUV will have to surface to recharge, making it easily detectable. Another energy source is wave energy, and this is the solution Northrop Grumman chose for manta ray. The company partnered with renewable energy company Ctrek to integrate technologies that allow manta ray to absorb energy from ocean waves, converting water movement into electricity. This enables the UUV to stay at the bottom of the ocean and recharge its batteries without being detected by the enemy. Additionally, manta ray is designed with multiple cargo compartments of various sizes and types to undertake different naval missions. These advantages open up great prospects for the US Navy, such as using manta ray as a surveillance system. Currently, the U.S. Navy relies on specialized surface ships and fixed sonar systems to track submarines, old methods that are easily detected and attacked. Future, the U.S. Navy could deploy a fleet of dozens of manta ray UUVs equipped with sonar systems to perform surveillance missions in different sea areas. Manta ray can also be used in anti-submarine warfare missions. These manta ray UUVs can carry weapons, such as lightweight MK-46 anti-submarine torpedoes, and fire when enemy submarines enter the firing range. A fleet of manta ray UUVs could become a mobile submarine killing network, capable of self-deployment from one area to another. Notably, the command and control capability integrated into the manta ray UUV allows it to perform long-duration autonomous missions, including underwater surveillance, data collection, and ocean exploration. The highlight of Manta Ray is its self-sustaining operation capability, including energy management and system maintenance without returning to the surface or a base for maintenance. This allows the UUV to learn and improve data over time, sharing new target data with other UUVs in the same system. Currently, world powers are actively researching and developing high-tech weapons and equipment to gain greater advantages at sea. Not only the United States, but Russia and China have also increased investment in UUVs in recent times. The unique features of these UUV versions could open up entirely new underwater combat methods for the navies of countries in the future.